Well, let's take this thing for a test drive now that I got air in the tires. Uh, the window's rolled down. It's not so hot in here. Got some garbage all cleaned out. Oh, it's even got the step side seats, whatever you call them. Let's see what she's like. It does run sweet. Clutch feels good. Got a tack. Even though the wheels look all funny, it seems to point the steering wheel straight. Got an audience. But there is one problem with this thing. I'll have to show you why it's sitting so funny. I'm going to need some help with a part. Alrighty. It actually drives a lot better than it looks. It drives like it doesn't have a lot of kilometers and that's the truth. But here's the problem. The reason it's sitting down so low on that side is this has torsion bar front suspension because it's four wheel drive and it's missing a torsion bar. You see, way back there, that's a piece of a torsion bar that's broke off. There's what the other one's supposed to look like. You know, it's good. And there's where it mounts. But for some reason, we're missing half of the mount. And of course, the whole torsion bar looks easy enough to replace. You just unbolt it and clamp it in here. But because this is such an old car, you can't find nothing like this in Canada. So when you're driving it, the axle, which you see there, that's all greasy, which there's the CV boot, is rubbing on the frame, and that's kind of bending on the axle. We don't want that to happen. So if anybody's got a torsion bar for that side of the vehicle, this is an 84 Nissan 4x4 truck, let me know. Or let me know where you could find one, because there's none of these left in Canada. They all rusted away 10 or 15 years ago. I haven't seen one on the road for years.